Okay, so we're going to add um, a link from a business photos onto your social media page. So the easy way of doing it is to nip over to the um, actual image you want to take. So this here is the image I'm looking to take. I've gone on to business photos, pick the image I like. Now you do a screenshot. If you are in um, Windows 7, you can use snipping tool. If you are in uh, Apple Mac, you can use grab tool. Once you've got that saved to your desktop, uh, then you're ready to start. So I've done that already just for speed. If you click on the link tool here, uh, you'll see you've got the short code or the actual link code here, which is already highlighted for you. Uh, you need to right click, um, or sorry, you, you can't right click on here. Uh, you'll have to uh, control or command C for copy. That's now copied that to your clipboard. If you're looking to embed this into your website, underneath you can see here, you've got this button section here where you can paste HTML to embed into a website. So you can you can select that if you want to. But for now, we're just putting a link. So we're going to head over to my Facebook page. This is my Facebook page here. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put our link in. But before we do that, the easiest way of making it work properly is to actually select the photo. So select photo. Uh, yeah, choose a photo and this is the coach house. So we're going to click on the coach house and stick that in there. Then we're going to embed the thing. So uh, embed the web code. So check out the coach house on Google Business Photos. Okay, and then put in the code. So now it's Command or Control V. And that's now pasted the code. So when someone clicks on that, that will then take them to the correct page. But they'll have the, the picture of the coach house. Okay, and uh, here we go. That's now posted. And we'll just wait for it to come up. And then you will see that the image has uh, worked down there. Look, so it's, it's popped down here. Okay, if I want to, to make this a bit of a highlight on my page, I can click here. I can pin it to the top. Uh, I can highlight it and so it's bigger and if you want to if the photo hasn't come into the right position you can actually reposition the photo here so there's a reposition photo and you can move it around for the optimum look so we're just happy with that click save and then people can now go and click on that just for ease I'm also going to show you it's over on Twitter so you can do the same on Twitter so if we go to you're logged in Twitter I'm going to put a new note in again I will start with the photo personally so we're going to go to the coach house, check out the coach house, and go on here, check out the coach house on Google Business Photos. Now what I would recommend is very often you put some information about where you are, the location. So we're going to put on here, uh, hashtag Oh, hashtag great Missenden. Don't need to just put in to the back. Um, there we are. So check out the coach house on Google Business Photos, and we've got the picture there. All we now need to do is put the link in. The link's there, and uh, we can now tweet that out. And if it goes. So. Uh, Thank you very much for watching that. If you need any other assistance, just either email me or tweet me, and uh, I'll uh, respond accordingly. Thank you. Bye-bye. Just another quick tip. the um, If you are doing uh, this, the massive link looks untidy, and if you want to tidy it up so you don't end up with this um, big link down here, so you see how it looks here, it looks pretty untidy. If you want to make it tidier, the easiest way of doing that is to grab this link, so highlight the text, and uh, then command or control C to copy. Then if you Google um, URL shortener, it will Google take you to this place, so it'll be Google URL shortener. Uh, or you can put in the actual code for it is goo.gl. So it's quite clever really. Um, you will have an option here to paste the link. So if you click in that box and you do command or control V, it will paste the, the link into here. You'll then click up a little box say shorten URL. Um, it will give you a little box just here uh, where my um, mouse is here. Uh, initially we have to put in a couple of numbers just to verify that you are a person, not a robot. It will then give you a, um, 
a short code here, as you can say, goo.gl with a with a number, alphanumeric number at the end. That will take you to the same place as this code. So it says on here to highlight this, so you highlight it and you do command or control copy. Uh, at this point you now have the short code. So if we go back over to the photos here, you see if I now paste uh, command or control V with this highlighted, click V, it now gives me a little code there. That little code is exactly the same piece of code that we'd already tried to embed, but obviously you can see much, much tidier. Thank you.